if I was going to die here, I was going to put up a fight, and that's basically what I did. For Samson Parker, it could have all ended here, near burnt grass on his Kershaw County farm, where Parker noticed a corn stalk stuck in this old rusty picker. I went up with my hand and the rollers that take the shucks off the corn. I uh, had grabbed, grabbed a glove and pulled my hand up into the rollers. The more I tried to pull my hand out, the further up in the rollers that it continued to go. On his knees, his hand stuck in the picker, Parker tried yelling out for help. No one answered. Would have probably have passed out and probably would have bled to death before somebody would have got here. An hour passes, Parker's hand goes numb, and he can't wait any longer. With this rod, he's able to jam the machine. Then, Parker reaches in his pants. This is the John Deere pocket knife that I had, and I was actually cutting away the, uh, my fingers that was up in there, like this. But before he can cut himself free, rod and machine start to spark. It was almost like a gasoline fire. I mean, it just all of a sudden went woof. His right hand still stuck in the machine. Parker now uses his left to fight the spreading grass fire around him. My skin was melting. I mean, it was just dripping off my arm like plastic, melting, melting plastic. So then I realized I was in trouble. And he was desperate, so Parker reached back in his pocket and grabbed his knife. And I just jammed it into my arm. I mean, this this just like that. Um, just, just started cutting the meat away from the bone. And once I cut all the, the meat off the bone, and I, I just dropped. His right arm now cut off, his body badly burnt. Parker drives to the road in front of his home. A firefighter from the town of Kershaw passes by. My biggest fear was this guy's going to die on me right here and there's not anything else I can do other than what I've done. What Doug Spinks did was pull over, wrap Parker's arm and call for help. I'm thankful I was there. So is Parker, crediting Spinks with saving his life. Still see some of the, the blood splattered marks where it burnt. Back on his farm, the idle corn picker still sits. But Parker is moving on and he says he isn't upset with anyone or anything. I came down and had a, a prayer with, uh, with God and the corn picker and me and, and it was kind of made it easy, you know, just, just made peace with it, and just thankful to be alive and to be here and uh, do an interview with you. So. <laughs> In Kershaw County, Dan Torgman, WIS News 10.